Hello and welcome to Silverstone, the home of British motorsport, where it's safe to say the Mercedes-AMG Petronas F1 team are hard at work, getting ready for the season ahead. With the first race in Bahrain just 17 days away, Toto, Lewis and George, it's time to get down to business. And Toto, I'll kick off with yourself. It's been a busy winter and big news announced. Yeah, very busy winter. Obviously, it's going to be our last season with Lewis. Um, so we're keen in bringing a really uh, quick car. And then uh, in the factory, hard working to deliver the product, which we shall see today how, how it goes. And Lewis, Toto mentioned it there. It's your last season with the team. I'd love to talk to you about your last few weeks and thoughts about the season ahead. Yeah, well, it's obviously been emotional. It's very surreal to be here, given the uh, I came here in 2013. Um, so 11 years with the team, starting in my 12th, and it is um, it is such a privilege to to work with a group of people where you you see the work they're doing over winter. We go through this process over the last couple of years. You see a, a car come together at the beginning of the year. It's the most exciting part of the, uh, of the season, really. Um, it's what you see in everyone's launches. You see that this is the first time I've seen the car the car come together as a whole. But to know everything that's underneath the hood. Um, which people won't get to see, but we, George and I, will get to experience on the track. It's, um, yeah, it's, it's exciting. Exciting is the word. And George, you're doing this now for your third season here. How do you feel about the challenge ahead? Yeah, really excited for the year ahead. As Lewis said, there's been so much work going on over this winter. We've learned so much over the last two years with these new regulations of cars. And it really is uh, an exciting part of the year because you're going into the unknown. We've done so many laps on the simulator, so many meetings, conversations with the designers, the engineers, everybody bringing this car to life. We just want to get behind the wheel now and see, see how it performs. Well, you've teed this up perfectly, George, because it's time to turn our attention to the reason that we're all here today, the Mercedes AMG W15 E Performance. And Toto, just in terms of the process, what's it been like watching this car come together? Yeah, it's been amazing. I can't remember all of us being so interested in finally starting the car up, firing it up and seeing, seeing how it is um, and, and realizing this is a complete relaunch of, of a car. It is very different, um, not only on the aerodynamic surfaces, but mainly underneath. There are so many mechanical changes that we have done, which we hope are going to translate into more performance, more predictability, a car that the drivers can really push. And we will we'll see it next week in Bahrain. And talking about Bahrain, this is just one step in the road to Bahrain. But in terms of the launch day itself, how much of a personal milestone is it? Yes, yeah, like Louis said before, this is the best moment um, because over the winter so many people have worked on the car and you're seeing it uh, in the wind tunnel and you see the drawings and then for the first time it's in front of you. And, and for me, when you look at delivery this year, we've gone a step back to the silver, but the, the color combination is amazing between the silver, the Petrona screen, the black car, which, which is something that we had for many years and going to stay with us, and then lots of red um, uh, as, a, as, a, as a nice touch.